this is our SMS panel or software by which you can send SMS. You can send SMS from three routes, from transactional route, from promotional route, from promotional sender ID route. You can see balances in all the three routes from this drop down. First of all, what is transactional route? Transactional route is the route from which you can send only informative SMS. No, no promotional SMS could be sent from transactional route. You can send information, for example, you can send information for parents teacher meeting in your school. You can send information regarding the results of your students in the school. The transactional SMS are also sent used by banks for cash in ATM for the transaction done in ATM. Promotional SMS are those SMS which are used for any kind of promotions. Promotional SMS use, for example, you can see the daily Domino's offer. Those are the pro promotional SMS. In transactional route, the sender ID could be changed. In promotional route, the sender ID remains same. And in promotional sender ID route, also the promotional ID, sender ID remains same. From sender ID, you can change the sender ID from which you have to send the SMS. Every time you change the sender ID, it comes up in the list here. For example, if I change the sender ID from here, MSGTST, it becomes MSGTST. And if the user sends same sender ID for sending all of his SMSs, he can change the default sender ID from his account settings. As he goes to the account settings, here's the sender ID option. He can change and update. This is how the sender ID option works. In promotional, in promotional route, the sender ID remains same. And, but when the receiver receives the SMS, he receives the SMS in numeric form, not the sender ID or alphabetical form. And from promotional sender ID route, the SMS sent will be received from the sender ID written over here. In promotional sender ID route, you can change the sender IDs, same as you can change in transactional route. From the second column, you can put the numbers on which you have to send SMS. If I put the number this, you can send SMS. You can put the comma and type all the numbers on which you have to send the SMS. Either you can press enter and put up the numbers. You can also send the SMS from groups. You can make those groups from our phone book option. You can send directly to the groups. You can add contacts in your group from phone book option. You can send to the particular group. You can send to the single numbers. You can send through our import CSV option. Import CSV option is generally used when you need to send SMS for huge number list. You can directly send SMS from import CSV option as you choose the file and upload it from your system. We have given a download sample file option from which you can get the sample of the CSV file in which you need to save the numbers. You can see the downloaded file. Here is the format contact number column. First column should be of contact number. And when you put all the list of the numbers on which you have to send SMS, you can then save your file going in the file option in save as option. You can put up the name for suppose I, I am writing demo. You have to save it in CSV comma delimited format and you can save it in desktop or in whatever folder you want. I'm saving it in DOS desktop. I've saved, saved it. Now, now I can directly choose the file from C upload from desktop and I can get the file over here and I can send the SMS. Next option is description. It shows the description or the SMS which you want to send. The flash on checkbox shows that when the checkbox is clicked, the SMS will not be saved in the incoming box or in the inbox of your phones. It will just flash on on the screen. From the English drop down, 
you can send the SMS in English or in Unicode. In English, you can send characters up to 160 and in Unicode and the credit will be 1. And if the character limits exceed 160, the cred credit limit exceeds 2 and accordingly. From Unicode, Unicode means any other language rather than English. The limit for Unicode is 70 characters. As, as you type the characters, the as you type the characters, the limit exceeds from here. As the 29 goes to 160 or increases 160, then the credit will be 2. And accordingly, the credit limit exceeds. Our next is, you can see XYZ classes. This shows the signature. As I write for demo, the signature, every time I send the SMS, the signature will be for demo. If I enable the signature, the signature will be for demo. And if I don't enable it, the signature will be sent for once. Enabling signature will send the signature in all the SMS you sent. You can also schedule the SMS through schedule option. For example, I need to send SMS on these all these numbers on like tomorrow's date. So I'll do, I'll change the date and I'll save changes. The SMS will be sent on the time and the date I've scheduled it. And when I will click on send, the SMS will be sent. So this is how our transactional route balance or our transactional SMS works. Same as promotional SMS works, but just the sender ID remains same in the promotional SMS. In, in promotional sender ID, the sender ID is being changed and the same sender ID is being seen in the mobiles. Th this is how our send SMS option works. Thank you.